Hours before he was to be put to death, a Texas inmate with a history of schizophrenia received a stay of execution. The U.S. Fifth Circuit Court of Appeals on Wednesday issued the stay for Scott Panetti, who was on death row for the fatal 1992 shootings of his in-laws in Kerr County. The court said it wanted to look at late arriving and complex legal questions in the case. Governor Rick Perry and his successor, current Attorney General Greg Abbott, took turns this week addressing border security and immigration. First up, Perry, who outlined an executive order that requires state agencies to use E-Verify, a federal electronic employee verification system that aims to prevent hiring of illegal immigrants. Perry and Steve McCraw, Texas Department of Public Safety Director, also detailed the plans to extend the next phase of Operation Strong Safety, the deployment of increased law enforcement to the border. Abbott laid out the state's plan to join more than a dozen other states in suing the Obama administration over the president's recent executive order protecting as many as five million undocumented immigrants from deportation. The order would allow parents of kids here legally a chance to stay in the country if they meet certain criteria. Abbott said President Obama overstepped his constitutional authority in issuing the order. I'm Alana Rocha. For more on these stories, plus Texas' latest pursuit for a Medicaid waiver, visit texastribune.org.